Bonjour my friends, I'm Frankie and welcome to Club Foodie Tips and Tricks. I like to make a nice rotation when it comes to vegetables. It can be green beans, corn, broccoli, asparagus, squash, eggplants, zucchinis and so on. Cauliflower is also on that list and today I'll show you the easiest way to cut this cruciferous vegetable. So my friends, let's get cooking. Here's a beautiful head of cauliflower and the first thing we'll do is to peel off the leaves which by the way are edible. Actually the whole vegetable is including the stem. So we'll keep the nicest leaves and use them for other recipes like in a soup, stew or even in a salad. Now that they're mostly removed we'll cut the stem straight down like this. Again don't discard anything. Using a paring knife we'll cut all the way around the stem to remove it. Voila! Nice and clean. From here it'll be easier to remove the remaining leaves leaving us with the core. If there are some stubborn ones use a knife. Why fighting? See how clean it is? This will make the task easier when we cut the florets without having knife marks in them. As I mentioned earlier the stem is also edible but the other layer on the lower half of the cauliflower is a little tough so simply peel it off before adding it to a recipe. In fact the top half is quite tender. Alright so now we'll cut it into florets. Using the same paring knife we'll cut it close to the core and snap it off. There! And we'll go around until they're all separated from the core. There won't be any marks from the knife making the florets nice and neat. At the end we'll be left with this which we'll keep for later use. If they are bigger florets we'll simply cut them slightly and snap them off just like this. Easy peasy. Now if there are some little black dots like this one we'll take the tip of our knife remove and discard them. The same applies to brown spots. We'll cut them off and discard them. As you saw in this video it's easy to prep a cauliflower without any waste. I hope you enjoyed tips and tricks of the day and for many more including recipes visit cupfoodie.com. Until next time my friends, bon appétit!